if you're still single, hold men to the same moral standards that you hold yourself. Hello, sugar and beautiful people. You see this particular girl that just used her video? She's an agent of evil. And she's bitter. And she wants to tag along our young ladies and women with her. Because if not, go and check a page. Most especially the first, second video, she pinned on a page. And check the rest. You will see that she has a mission. On her second video in her page, she's talking about a particular guy that uh, said she wants to marry a pharmacist. So because she wants to open a pharmacy that is a marriage a business. Yes, marriage is a business. In fact, marriage should be a profitable business for both of us if you know what we are doing. Let's go back to our fathers, our forefathers. When you are married, multiple women, I have plenty of children. It's because they know that if they have multiple women, the, those women will go ahead there in their family business. And when those women give birth to children, the children too will tag along before they go to school or they come back from school or during their holidays, they will go and help their father in farm. And that's why you see that majority of these women can never divorce because they contributed a lot. And they want their children to benefit from those contributions. And they too. But when the Bible and Quran that the British or the white people come to come and deceive Funa. Now, one woman, one man. It's still business, but now it's not benefiting the woman more. Yes. Benefiting with you. Because now majority of them will say, men must do this, men must do that. Men. And they are not ready to pay the price of our mothers. So let me tell you, if marriage is not business, in Western world, why is it that most women, they, once they divorce, eh, they want a cut, 50% of the man's wealth. What does that call? Because the African men wake up on time. Then in a way, we are still maga. Because African man now who pay house rent, who pay uh, school fees, who, who some even buy car, buy fuel to fuel the car, do service. You know, some men I know men that do, and I do that, and by his grace, I've been married for fifteen years, over. So, if you are saying all this, you are saying in your page, is it to help the women or to? demoralize them bring them down or you want them to be like the way you are because it's bitter true you are not happy because i don't know what you want to benefit in all this you are saying let me even go back to that western world now, if you see any ladies from in the diaspora that wants to marry a man in Nigeria, do you think she just wants to do it because now you find pass? Or there's no any other man in their uh, 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 country? No. Some men in that, they already wise up. But I know that you are here. Majority of us that have Ojukokuro, because me, I'm not one of them. I know what I want. 
It is for you to come and support. It's not because he just wants a man to come and be climbing here or he wants he, uh, some of them already even have children. Because they know where you are there. Things will be smoothing for them. And I'm not blaming them. Marriage is a business. It is. So wake up. Know what you feel to people. And you know, most people that come to your page, I could see some other people uh, uh, commenting on that, most of your posts. Uh, some are, they, they, they hear it with emotion. And life is logical, it's practical. So, and at the end of the day, they will end up to be bitter like you. Because if it's easy for you, if you enjoy marriage, if you are so lucky, you will be saying this, you are saying. Let us wake up. Young men and young women. And it's like now, maybe we too will be waking up our young boys. I know that they already wake up, Shah, but we'll still make them realize what is there in marriage. Is a business that's why you see an actor marrying an actor that's why you see a musician marrying a musician because both of them a banker married the fellow an engineer married fellow an engineer because a lawyer married go and check it when they marry themselves they understand what it is they can help their business together and grow and that is for a woman that really wants to do something that has something upstairs that is not saying, now nah, man be head, you must do everything. And you still want to have a say. Marriage is a business. When you invested well, then you have a say. So stop deceiving our young women. And parents too, you need to train your children well. Let them understand what it is. Be responsible. My mother taught me how to be responsible 100%. A man needs to be responsible. And know your value is a key. You know...